Malta has always been very, very resourceful. Throughout the ages, we managed to overcome big challenges despite of our small size. And we have the same proactive approach in the Maltese film industry. We have basically a new vision and a new strategy. Um, this is based on three main points. Investing in human resources. We just launched, in fact, a new training program. Investing and upgrading the infrastructure so that productions companies um, have better filming facilities in Malta and revise the financial incentives to make Malta much more competitive. Creative Europe is a very, very good initiative. However, we feel that it needs to take into consideration the limitations of uh, small countries like Malta. Many Maltese companies cannot access these European funds simply because of their strict conditions related to their experience and, and past projects. Uh, our companies are small and don't have many projects in their portfolio. They need help to compete uh, on an international level and it's a pity that the European system is putting them at a disadvantage rather than helping them further themselves. Well, the tax incentives are being revised. We basically want to make the island much more competitive and eventually uh, Malta will be able to attract even more films. Lately we had very, very good productions, uh, World War Z, um, Captain Phillips, to name a few very recently. So we want to take this to the next level. But you will hear from us very, very soon about that. The vision is to have a proper Maltese film industry. Malta has always been very famous for servicing international films. We worked on big films like Gladiator, Troy, Munich, World War Z, and most recently Captain Phillips. But now we need to start producing our own films as well. Uh, we are investing in the right training courses and creating new opportunities for Maltese filmmakers. We really believe in the potential of the film industry. So apart from revising the film rebates, the, the cash rebates, the Film Commission is also introducing a new international co-production fund. This is a first for Malta and the aim is to help Maltese companies join forces with international companies to produce films, mainly on a European level. The fund will be officially launched in the next few months and it is already attracting a lot of interest. I believe that this is a new chapter for co-production between Maltese and European producers.